some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. Today's video takes us to Holden, Massachusetts, where we find Fupa Face, aka Little Johnny Boy, as he is taking part at a new Tide Pod Challenge. Oh, no, not Tide Pod Challenge, I'm sorry, but new Frauditor Challenge of Filming Banks. And the police are called, and unfortunately, he IDs himself. Oh, poor little Frauditor, what are your butt buddies gonna say? I'm sure they must not be happy with you at this point, considering no true Frauditor IDs himself. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get this frickin' S show on the road, shall we? Right here in the main street of Holden, so we're gonna be doing our normal thing. We're gonna be out here exercising the First Amendment rights to record in public, so. Holden is a pretty affluent town, so. Okay. So that you can go and do this exact same thing on Google Maps. So yes, 100%. Don't you think if I was actually trying to rob or case a bank that I would go in and just not tell you I'm recording and just go and walk no, in? You'd, no. That's no. You'd be I need I need pictures from the sidewalk to rob a bank. Well, Is that what you're saying? What we're saying. How does that make sense to you? Watch people walk out when people walk in. Okay, so is it people are uncomfortable or you're rob you're worried about me robbing a bank? Well, we Mix them both. You're giving that impression off, my friend. Really? So we're, yeah, we're okay. not trying to come at you and be confrontational, we're just letting you know you're making a comfortable. Okay, so let me ask you a question. Do you respect and uh, approve of the First Amendment right to record in public? Uh, I mean, yeah, if it's an amendment, Perfect. Sure, awesome. but however, do All right. you not respect people in general? I respect people. Have I not been anything but respectful to you? To answer your question, Johnny, a bank robber is going to take every opportunity to get every bit of intel they can possibly get on every detail of that bank if they decide that they want to rob it. That means a lot of hours of recon, which uh, basically means filming the bank to figure out when the armored cars uh, come and restock the bank or take money away. And there are times they will employ rubes, such as yourself, to uh, do their recon for them. Yeah, they'll pay some dumb, impressionable pile of crap, such as yourself, who doesn't know any better, to do their dirty work for them. There we go. All right. Well, look, let me tell you something. If you have customers that are uncomfortable, it, you said you know about the First Amendment, so why don't you just go tell them that I have the right to do exactly what I'm doing and to not, instead of exasperating people's fears, why not just quell them and say, hey, look, he's on the sidewalk. He's expressing his First Amendment right that you also have well, to record on the sidewalk. Your, your opinion. We appreciate that. No, 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 no. It's the First Amendment. I don't understand the First Amendment. So then how is that an opinion? You are made of stupid. That back down. to go have something to eat really quick because I was just about to film an outro to tell you guys that this was a very short video and I've had zero interaction. Dumbass! You dumbass! You're a dumbass! Such a dumbass! You're an ass! Oh come on now, Fupa Face, you're giving the game away. You're not supposed to say the quiet part out loud. You're not supposed to tell everybody that's what you're looking for is the negative interactions. Are you sure you're frauding material? Because that was quite a the rookie mistake right there, boy. So I wonder what this guy's got to say. Vehicle. Stay in your vehicle. I'm in my vehicle, man. What's going on? I get your license and registration, please. License and registration? Yep. For what? Because you're possibly upsetting people over here. Excuse me? I need your license and registration. Okay, is this a traffic violation? Yeah, it is. It is? Yep. It is a traffic violation. Can I get your name and badge number while I get this? Yeah, it's H3. H3, what's what's your name? Macaro. Why are you blocking my restricting my first amendment right? I'm not right here. So you can do whatever you want. Hey Fupa face, 
I got a question for you. How those lawsuits go for you? Oh yeah, that's right. They ended up getting thrown out of court because you had no case to begin with. Isn't that right? Yeah, that had to be it. And it couldn't have had anything to do with the atrocious grammar that you put on your lawsuits now, did it? Oh uh, yeah, that might be part of it. Look at how childish this guy is. Yeah, I'm the child. So there's that. Huh. Didn't even want to stick around and wait for my registration. Poopa face, you, you did it. You, why, why did you do that? Why did you give your ID? It's supposed to be a Fourth Amendment violation, is it not? Oh, Fupa face, I'm so disappointed and shocked and amazed that you did this. Yeah, what about your fellow frauditors, Fupa face? Uh, what about them? What about Chili? What about your, well, hero Chili? Uh, what is he going to say about this, Fupa face? You might not want to contact him for a while. He might be in a bad mood because of that, and he might disown you. So, yeah, be careful with that, buddy. Please do be careful. He might end up also biting your head off and sucking you dry of every dime that you have left. So, today here, guys, if we have to, we're going to be uh, invoking the Fifth Amendment right to stay silent. Right away. Here's another one. Yeah, go ahead. Try to make Chili proud by using that trifold right there. Yeah, even though it really doesn't work that much on traffic stops, you doofus. Hey, officer, can I have a, can I just ask you a question really quick? <whistles> huh. Didn't understand the whistle. So, let's see what happens here. I'm really intrigued to see what's going on. So, I know there, guys, I know that uh, I was not, I know that I was not committing a law. <laughs> so, I know there, guys, that I was not breaking any laws or anything like that, but just to not try to cause the disturbance, I know, uh, if you want to look at it that way, I am giving up my rights, but you know what? Um, clearly, this guy wants to ID me because... I was hurting other people's feelings out there. I don't know if that's exactly it. So you're gonna have to bear with me because I am in my vehicle and Massachusetts is a very, very blue state. So I don't want him to say he came up in my vehicle and my vehicle was on or anything like that, which it was for a minute. So uh, just, just in case anything in court, that was the reason why I gave him my ID. Hey, Fupa face, that's a really pathetic argument right there that you gave up your ID because Massachusetts is a blue state. Yeah, why don't you try going to Texas, which is a ruby red state, and trying this there? Because you know damn well that they would throw you under the jail in Texas should you try any of this BS there. So we're gonna see how he takes it from here and uh, see what happens. Oh, I wonder what the verdict is here. Were you on the bank property? Were you on the bank property? I mean, I'm just asking you a question. You can't answer it? Nope. Okay. Don't go on the bank property. They don't want you there. There you go. Wow. Look at the childishness and the rudeness. Am I detained or am I free to go? Thank you. Look at the childishness of this officer. You know, Fupa Face, I'm sensing a little bit of projection here. Are you compensating for something? Perhaps uh, all your failed attempts at frauding, perhaps all your uh, failed attempts at uh, launching careers in boxing uh, and everything like that. Yeah, I'm sensing a little bit of frustration right here with you. 9463. Excuse me, sir, can I get your name and badge number before you go just so I know who responded? Look at the ridiculousness. 
So hey, let me let me ask you let me ask you a question here. So what for what he just ID'd me for? Do you think that's a lawful ID right there? Yeah. Yeah, you yeah. do. For what crime? For what crime? Okay. Okay. Was the crime? Heads up, sir. Heads up, sir. So the old me would have absolutely in that situation, I would have blown up on the cop and not given him my ID and I most definitely would have taken the ride because he would have got me for either failure to ID and or impeding his investigation on my traffic stop, so to say, because my keys were in the ignition. But that is not the FAPA way. Have the events of the past year changed you in some way, Fupa face? I want to know about this marvelous transformation of yours. So we gave him the ID because let alone in Massachusetts, but there is not a judge in the country that would side with me over a police officer while asking for my ID while I was in the car and had the keys in the ignition. So that's why I gave him the ID. So if you enjoyed the video, make sure you leave a like and a comment and tell me what your favorite part was about these two Jamok police officers. So are you walking back your previous statement about uh, this would only happen in a blue state such as Massachusetts? Or are you just as confused as you always have been and don't know how to present proper arguments or even a structured line of reasoning to begin with? Yeah, I think that's about it. He doesn't know how to present a decent argument. He doesn't know how to be a proper boxer. He's failed at being a fraud editor. He's failed at everything he's done. So, yeah, he's just no good at anything. Auditor, you've got to find something you're good at and stick with it. Even if it's uh, being a dishwasher at Longhorn Steakhouse or something like that, you got to figure it out. So, at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next one. This could be some groundbreaking stuff right here. Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's- Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that?